Old media. Yes, man. Am I the only person that hate formal dining occasions? Now, I am from the generation where they try to teach proper dining etiquette, but um, it never quite got true. Because you don't need that shit to eat fast food. The most you need for them some fast food and just the two on them. I honestly don't see why I need 15 different spoons and 30 different fat and 17 different plates to eat your food. On a love wash plate? Now, every once in a while, you feel yourself and you feel like you want to go to a restaurant. And that is when I'm reminded how much I cannot stand formal dining now first of all as soon as you set foot in that bitch it dark like dracula closet hello is there anybody in here God, shit. i don't know baby I, I must trip over one of the waiters them a while ago. Lights are always dim. Why are you always trying to set a mood? I came to eat, not to have sex. Waiter, can I have a glass of water and um, one more thing before you go? Some light. Now for some of these places you have to make reservations to go there. What you need to reserve is a couple hundred watt bulbs for this goddamn dungeon. Now, now mash up my eyesight. Then after you wait a little bit, you get your seat and then present you the menu. Shit, those goddamn menus. I don't like ordering from menu. Reason being, the name of the food that you want to order is hard to rasp pronounce. Especially if it's an international foreign language themed restaurant. Alright, I'll have the um... Pussy crab. You mean the puse le carbacer? Yeah, pussy lee crab. No, that, that the right doesn't. The puse le carbacer. Yeah, pussy lee crab. That, that, that's a virgin. You know what I start doing after I look at the menu and then them ask me, Are you ready to order, sir? Yeah, 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 more harder, man. Make sure you get this, you know. More harder, uh, one dictionary, one encyclopedia, and uh, thesaurus. So I can learn to pronounce the name of the shit when I try if it harder for it. And if you know none of that, just give me the Wi Fi password so I can Google it. And if you I already don't have a hard time to pronounce things off of the menu. The prices will give you a friggin' heart attack. All right, all right, all right I'm so more. Uh... Yeah. Uh, uh. Price, Some of the prices that they have on the menus don't make no goddamn sense, especially for shit. When we can make a yard, this is when the food expenses. As soon as you open the menu, shut it back. I'm so more of a eat, you know. Fix it, Jesus. These prices cannot be real. Jesus, it's still dead. It's still dead, Jesus. Fix it. Time is the key to the restaurant business. Let me explain. The time you take to give me the food is key to whether or not me pay for that rice. Someone will take forever to for prepare the food and send it come to people. The white squall from my mouth have white squall. If me order something, you prepare it too fast. It is already the wrong day. A smarty order and left you try to give me no one. Kiai back to rice. And if the food take too long to come and it cold, kiai back to Ross. And then you have the waiters who refuse to pay your mind. Excuse me. Hey, yes. excuse me. Hello? Excuse me. Excuse me. Alright, cool. Go on like in a year. Let me attack. See? Can you know you me a card? Cool, cool. Yeah, you hear me now. We can get some raw ketchup, please. And there's this thing that they always do when they drizzle food on the plate, especially when they're giving you dessert. Um, I don't know if you guys noticed, but how much money may I pay for this raw liquor dessert or so? No, waste my money I drizzle nothing upon a raw plate. Oh, I go care, go back around this so or wash off. Drizzle it upon my food. For no drizzle it upon the plate, may I lick out the plate. <laughs> and what the hell is up with this surface charge? Like, I don't have a right to choose whether or not me tip you anymore. But then again, I don't really believe in tipping. You get a tip at the end of the month from your boss. It's called your paycheck. Of course it is good to have certain etiquettes. As for using them, I'm not really know. Because some of them are goddamn necessary. Yo, it's your boy Kevin Too Crazy. Hit the like button, hit the share button if you don't like formal dining just like me. And also subscribe. Think it, believe it, and live to achieve it.